Welcome to JSA TV, the newsroom for telecom and data center professionals. I'm Barb Mitchell coming to you live today from the floor of PTC 23 in sunny uh, Waikiki, Hawaii. And joining me here today is Anna Claiborne, CTO, Chief Product Officer and Co-Founder at Packer Fabric. So uh, thank you. you. You almost got that all. I, I commend you. It was a lot. Thank you. <laughs> we, we rehearsed that ahead of time. Yeah. Uh, Anna, it's so great to, to have you here. And, it's great to be uh, here. Great show so far. Have you, it's been a busy week. What's your... It has been a very busy week. I gave a talk the other day and, um, you know, I kind of, I, I ran here and I managed to make it here. I think the, this is the first thing I've genuinely been on time for. Oh, so, so yeah. yeah. So congratulations. congratulations. Yeah, that's good. Every, everyone here should feel very honored. I was very yeah, on time on for this. time for the live <laughs> interview here. Um, and so I know that it's an especially big event for, for you, for Packet Fabric and, and also Unitas. There's uh, some big news happening. I'll, I don't want to steal your thunder, so oh. tell us all about thank it. Thank you, thank you. Yeah. Yes, so there's a merger between Packet Fabric and Unitas. So we're bringing together the automation and assets of both companies to give customers a true edge to everywhere experience. And so that means that customers are going to be able to design, price, order, and manage first mile, middle mile, access to cloud, access to SaaS companies, all through our amazing software tools that everybody has loved at both companies separately, and they'll now be coming together. Yep. And um, we're also going to gain the capabilities of uh, Unitas's internet network, which is AS1828, which is a truly amazing, amazing network. It's very, it's very extensively peered. It's got great connectivity and reach. And we're going to be adding some really fantastic automation capabilities to make it even easier to now buy the internet or to actually make it so you can buy the internet on the internet. I've always found it very ironic that the one thing you can't get on the internet is transit or really right. any network capabilities at all. Yeah. Well, this is, I mean, obviously this is big news and I, I will say, you know, it's been, I've been, you know, obviously out and about as we all have here at, at PGC and it's, it's been you know, people are buzzing about this. It's being talked about. That's and so good. that's good, right? That's I always know, a I good like, thing. I, yeah, 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 I like being talked about. This right. is great. Yeah, in a, in a good way. So, you know, talk, and you, you hint, alluded to it a little bit in, in terms of the offerings of, you know, the different, com of both companies. But what does this really mean for the industry, you know? So, I mean, in the, in the bigger picture here, uh, what this means is that we're going to be really, truly the first fully automated carrier network. And so that means all the capabilities that uh, customers would typically look for, whether you need, you know, internet access from the data center, um, whether you need DIA from like your office locations, um, if you need hybrid cloud, multi-cloud, if you want to more closely peer with your SaaS providers to get better application performance, um, all of that capability is going to be available with just a couple clicks, button clicks, or through an API. And so in terms of, um, you know, the, the 10,000 foot, uh, this is pretty revolutionary because the one thing that Telcom has never done is really step into the modern age of software and software as a service. And so that's what, um, you know, I like to look at it that we're modernizing an entire industry. Yeah. Amazing. Yeah. Well, and so I, you know, it's good time for this, it feels like it's the start of a new year, right? And and we're here as an industry together, and everyone's sort of thinking about what's what's ahead uh, for the industry, but for their own organizations and for the partnerships that are being built and fostered and and uh, furthered here. Um, and so, what do you see for the next? I, I sense it's going to be a busy time, you know. But what does the next sort of short term and then longer term look like for you? Uh, in the in the in the short term right now, I mean, obviously, you know, mer merging companies is is a thing. Uh, yeah. <laughs> it does it does require some time and attention, but we're going to put very heavy emphasis on our product set because it's really changing the way that people are buying. It's allowing enterprises to go from having to expend a lot of capital on um, on network, you know, to buy network equipment, do the big hardware purchases, the circuit provisions, all that and convert that into an OPEX model. And so the more the more efficiently that we get those products out there and into consumers' hands, yep. the better off everybody is. Right. So it's gonna be a lot of heavy, that's you know, a very long way of saying that it's going to be a lot of uh, very heavy product focus um, and making sure that we're really rolling things out on the product roadmap. 
Yeah. Well, well, congratulations. I mean, this is Thank you. great news. And, uh, you know, yes, like we said, a lot, a lot still to do, I'm sure, but uh, so many great benefits for, for your customers and for the industry. And so, yeah, I think congratulations again. And, and so is there anything else before we wrap that you just want to make sure our, our viewers, I keep saying not everyone's as lucky as we are to be here. So not everyone gets to meet with you in person, you know, this week, but for those who, who can't. Well, I am pretty fun. If you, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, well, I guess my talk was yesterday, so I can't tell people to come to my talk anymore. Right. Yeah. Uh, but one of the things that I would highly recommend that everyone out there do is check out our website to actually look out, um, look at the announcement. So that's packetfabric.com. We are retaining the packet fabric name. So yeah. it's great that we get to reuse all of our existing marketing material. We're saving, we're saving the planet right. one, one tree at a time one, there. One yeah. Sheet at a time. Yep. <laughs> yep. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> and so please stop by our website. Um, you can register, uh, to try the product out. You can also register to talk to a salesperson, um, and you can read more about all of our capabilities there. Uh, and you can also go to our docs. We have docs.packetfabric.com, which contains all of our API documentation, our knowledge base, which really goes extensively into our capabilities of how you actually connect, you know, do hybrid cloud, do multi-cloud, and because uh, one of the things that we ran into, at least early on, less less so now, people are growing more comfortable with the software model for network. So NAS, you know, network as a service, which we call NAS. Yeah. Um, but at first, you know, there's definitely hesitancy, like this can't be real. And, you know, they'd have to actually see it to believe it. So you can always get a demo too. Great. Well, thank you yeah. so much. And yeah. thank you so much for sharing your news here with us today and, and for joining us. Yeah. Thank yeah. you for having me. It's yeah, been great. Of course. Anytime. Yeah. Anytime. And, and thank you viewers for tuning in to JSA TV coming to you live today from PTC 23. We'll talk to you next time. Happy networking. Bye.